Hey, how's it going guys? Tanner Slay is coming at you guys with my first ever map analysis video for my game battles, singles, uh, you know, search and destroy strats. So if you guys just want to get on into it, let's do that right now. The first map is going to be standoff, so here we go. Getting on into the offense rounds of top gallery in standoff. As you guys can see, shooting across the windows is pretty typical on this map. Down the street, even that middle uh, head glitch box in the center there. And if you guys can, just get behind these boxes at A to stop that A push for anybody getting into the back of your spawn. If you can't sit back and use an AR, don't worry. The SMGs are pretty much well used on this map. Also, in this middle building, easily pick them off. It's 9 times out of 10. You will see somebody there. And if you guys are scared, if it's 3-3 last map, this head glitch for you is just given to you by Treyarch so just use this to the best of your abilities and you guys will win offense now that the offense sides are finished I'm going to be switching it up using my defense kind of strats that I've basically used every single time on standoff you guys are wondering why I'm using the M8 I just think it's really well-rounded uh, gun for this map long range and short range if you guys do like using that select fire attachment on this gun I personally don't I really do enjoy the burst uh, it's a four shot burst so it's, it's really it really comes in handy of hitting those close shots and winning those gunfights uh, if you guys do see there it's a great counter spot shooting those people behind the boxes back there and this is a great spot I use this every time it works out numerous times playing singles you just want to get outside right at this restaurant behind me and getting behind the b-bomb if you guys look you know if you're wondering hey what if they run behind the tank and you can't see them if you look closely there is that crack you have to uh, you know get a glimpse of that person running to a just put your crosshairs in the middle of that building just to have e equal reaction time uh, left and right if you guys don't see anything in this window just be careful and watch your back uh, I have hit this shot numerous times. I actually hit it with a sniper shot not too long ago in a GB a couple of days ago. So it can be done if you guys hit it. It is really worth your while. Now here I tried to throw something mixed in. Just wanted to show you guys some of my spots for the bomb where I plant B and A. Now it really does depend on what kind of settings you use. I know a lot of players will use silent bomb planting and some will not. I personally do not, but I always tend to keep a personal you know, visual of the bomb just in case. You never know if that person is going to be going on the bomb and spinning around. If you guys do not have bomb plant silent, then you just want to go over the bomb and just spin and defuse at the same time. It basically makes it silent. Uh, they did that in the first Black Ops, and it was kind of annoying at, at the start, but once you got the hang of it and you really just had to always get a, a good spot to see, this is some great numerous spots around restaurant. You just want to, you know, protect B. Basically, just look over down with elevation. Uh, and this is a great spot for A if you guys are just looking around. You know, kind of curious. Just, you know, you want to have the bomb somewhere where you can see. You never want to plant it on one side and typically just run to the other side of the map. You know, you're not going to win that round. Uh, here, if you're just looking one way and you don't see them, just check the other way. And you'll basically win uh, that bomb plant that you guys have put down on either bomb. So, hope you guys have enjoyed this video. My name is Tanner Slays. As always, you know, if you guys do want to leave the video a like, comment, and a favorite, that would mean the world to me. Uh, you know, I really do take a lot of time out of my day just to kind of put these videos together. Uh, like I said, I hope you guys have enjoyed again. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time. So if you guys want to see more of these videos, just let me know in the comment section below, and I will be gladly to do that. Let me know what kind of map. Uh, I just chose Standoff because this was my favorite map possibly so far in this game. It really does remind me of like a Call of Duty 2-ish kind of map. You know, it has that feel for me. So I hope you guys have enjoyed again. I know I've said that like three times, but I really do, you know, want to give you guys something entertaining to watch. So I'll catch you guys later, and see you later, guys. Have a nice day.